What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Slope Podcast. This podcast about your favorite Sakamichi series idols. No Zaka 46, Kiaki Zaka 46, and Yoshi Moto Zaka 46. We actually talk about them. Yes. Sometimes. When there's when there are things. I'm boy, and I'm joined by Josh and Jimmy. What's going on, everybody? Hey. Uh, just being a bad, bad co-host. I've been replaying Kingdom Hearts <laughs> 2 instead of watching the shows that I should be watching. It's fine. It's E3 this week, and there's a lot of gaming stuff. Mm-hmm. I don't blame you. I just I, I I saw Jack Sparrow with Sora. I heard I heard Goofy's voice tickle my ear again, and I just I just I had to, I had the call was too strong. I'm sorry. Uh, it it did not affect me whatsoever because I played Kingdom Hearts one and the tutorial of Kingdom Hearts two, and I gave up because the tutorial was horseshit. I'm sorry. It's, it's very long. I did watch the PlayStation one though, and like Death Stranding is like, what is this game, man? <laughs> what am I watching? You got the guy from Walking Dead, just scaring bodies. Dude. What is going on? But anyway, How have you guys uh, all been? Pretty good. We're just good? setting up. Um, I was busy setting up for the the the, the stream that we're doing this Friday, my dudes. <sighs> Hey. That's segue. Yes, we're gonna do a special stream with Time Bomb Nick. The on Time this, Bomb Nick on on this very Twitch channel that you're watching right now. You, you mean the, the Nick that everyone likes more than the, us? The Nick. <laughs> well, now it's fine you know that they like is. Nick more than us because he's well not part of this podcast. He's part of this group, mm. right? Part of Slope Club. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. so if they like Nick. Then they like then by, us. Then by connection, by they like us? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Like, okay. like uh, we're, we're just like the little uh, the little fall-offs that come off of like uh, the Nick. Sorry, uh, there's, there's some <laughs> sirens outside. Someone, someone's getting arrested outside. But yes, <gasps> tune in to that one. It will be a fun time. Mm-hmm. And after that... And after that, we're doing more streaming. Hooray. Gonna... That same day? I cannot announce what, because it pertains to they who must not be named. <laughs> oh yeah, we, we started, I forgot. <laughs> the Voldemort's of the show. The, 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 school, the show's already so live. We can't, we can't, we can't <laughs> mention them by name. Let's say there's a certain event that's going to happen later that day. That we're yeah, going we're we're to live stream. Everyone knows what it is. Uh, so tune in, it'll be cool. I feel bad uh, for that one person who, who who's just new to <laughs> idols, genuinely uh-huh. just coming onto this show and we're like, oh, I want to learn... What, what are they streaming? What? What? <laughs> I don't. I don't know what they're talking about. But you have to tune in and find out. <laughs> oh, It'll but I think cool. this live episode, this this finished episode, won't be out till like afterwards anyway. So oh yeah, mm-hmm. won't really matter. Yep. So let's get into the current events. Woo! I'm gonna fly through this, my dudes. So yeah, many. It's all Naga Hama Neru got a special prize for promoting tourism in Kyushu because she's from Nagasaki. Through her lewd photo book, everyone was like, mm, I'm going to go to Nagasaki now. Mm. Uh-huh. Yeah. Did you uh, guys get was, that feeling? I didn't. I never saw the book. I, I know you got the book because you had uh-huh. a video of uh-huh. it. But I, I didn't buy it. Well, I'm, I'm just saying, we can't really judge judge the people for, for coming out there. No, of course I mean, not. what did we do the second a Mayan photo book was shot it's, in L.A.? Well, we kind of we live around... Yeah, yeah, but I'm just saying, you know, there's got to be know. some people, like, just in that area that are fans. Are yeah, like, yeah, Oh, when we hit up Kyushu. But or, these, like, these articles imply that people came from all over Japan just to check out this oh, damn son. quaint little island town mm. or whatever Nehru's from. Nagasaki. But anyway, it was presented at the third Kyushu Miryoku Hakutsu Awards, which is, like, an, an event just to un- honor people who brought interest in the area or whatever mm. it's presented by the uh, jr kishu the japan rail of kyushu and so yeah because she she is kind of the ambassador mm-hmm. the tourism ambassador of nagasaki did a good job with her photo book then good <laughs> job did purpose. Meru. you did it <laughs> speaking of hiragana kiyakizaka <laughs> 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 which never was part of they had a, uh, what's that, a stage play or musical mm-hmm. called mm-hmm. Ayumi. 
Um, it's done now, I think. You know, they had two teams. Hiragana Kiyaki was split split off. They're going to mm-hmm. air the like stage of both teams later, well, in July. So, what, were the, what were the two different teams? Like, team, like... Oh, it was Team Harmonica and Team Castanet. Castanet and Harmonica. You know? They're musical instruments somehow. Yeah. Um, the Team Harmonica one will air on July 28th, and the Team Castanet one will uh, air July 29th. So we kind of... We finally are able to watch, I guess, if you're... I don't know. If you really wanted to watch it. Yeah, because not every single stage play or anything gets like premiered, or even shown on TV or anything, or let us see it. Uh-huh. Never get aired in any. I think the third, the Nogizaka third gen play was because I I saw clips of it. Was it? Yeah. It wasn't like news article things. No, like an actual, like tele TV rip, hmm. like DVR kind of thing. Hmm. So. Uh, I, there's pictures floating around that seem kind of interesting. They they like danced and sang, and but it was all in in like a white room. They were all wearing white. It was kind of interesting looking. Mm. So, if you really wanted to watch how good Iguchi Mao acts, <laughs> go check that out, my dudes. How did you pass the auditions? <laughs> <laughs> Look, no one said idols had to be good at anything, all right? Especially Japanese idols. That's yeah. not even a thing people look for, I don't think, through mm-hmm. uh, through um what's it, you know, through auditions, right? They just look for charming like mm-hmm. like something about them to catch short. Right? Yeah, yeah, to yeah. like develop and to mm-hmm. like help grow kind of thing. Mm-hmm. If you're already good then Yeah, you like, might be like you have nowhere to go up. I mean, like, yeah, it's it's like I want to feel like majority of the audition is so much like that X factor, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so does that mean someone's like really good at everything? They're like, nah, you're not good enough to be an idol. <laughs> they'll probably like, they'll probably take them, but they won't be center, mm. right? The center mm-hmm. always mm-hmm. has like a thing, mm-hmm. right? That that like a you realize flaw. when you watch them, right? Yeah. Or, so they, they, I don't know. There, there's something She's a special drug addict. <laughs> about the center that mm. usually isn't. Recovering alcoholic. There we go. See, there's mm. a story behind that. And this mm. is why mm. Josh Box should never be allowed to produce <laughs> an idol group. <laughs> right? It's just going to be a dumpster fire. It's, like it's, it's just, just going to be like all idols mixed with cute idols. It's going to be like the weirdest combination. Josh Box She's presents a re- <laughs> Shanghai 48. Oh. <laughs> Four. <laughs> Oh, yeah, she'd be like, wow, a recovering alcoholic is the center. She's only 16 years old. That's <laughs> Damn, son. <laughs> She's had a rough, all right? Yeah, speaking of Kiyakizaka. Drinky since the womb. What? <laughs> speaking of Kiyakizaka, they're, they're going to appear on J- Rock in Japan mm. this year once again. The mm-hmm. return. The return. It's, it's going to be just uh, Kenji. I mean, it's kanji only. Who else yeah, would it be? Cause, well, I mean, because, uh, well, I mean, I guess that makes sense. It just says Kiyagizaka. It doesn't say like, which one, though, right? Yeah, well, because it just says it in kanji, which is why I'm Oh, like, okay, no, so that's like, kanji. Yeah, it's the name is the kanji of the keaki. But then what if, like, uh, well, yeah, but what if the news sites don't know enough to, like, make that a mm. distinction? Oh. And we return to the inevitable truth <laughs> that this whole name thing is stupid. Mm. Ugh. <sighs> But no, it's kanji. They, they yeah, yeah, kanji. Yeah, it's kanji. Mm. The hey, picture hey, on the hey. website is kanji. Uh, but anyway, yeah, they're, they're going to be in Rock in Japan. There's no timetable yet as mm-hmm. to which stage they're going to be on. But last year, when they it was you know their first time on Rock in Japan, they headlined, not headlined, they they were f- first top batter of one of the big stages. So that's pretty cool, man. Usually mm-hmm. idol groups don't don't perform on the big stage mm-hmm. at Rock in Japan. They have like the smaller side stages or tents. Um, so yeah, they're popular is what I'm trying to get at. Are, are there going to be like five members performing this time? Oh man, maybe. <laughs> Every time, less and less numbers. No. Why do you do no. this, Josh? <laughs> Why do you just like saying hurtful things, Josh? <laughs> it's no, vi- no good vibes, dude. Just it's just going to be Josh Captains, Koike... Neru. <laughs> That's what's gonna yeah. be. Yep. 
But um, yeah, this, they're going to be one of the few idol groups that are going to perform at Rock in Japan. So, mm -hmm. Oh, good for them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is also the same weekend as I Tokyo Idol Festival. It hasn't been announced if Kiyaki Zaka is going to perform at Tokyo Idol Festival. I wonder, huh? But they probably will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. It's a busy week for them. Busy, busy. But I don't think. Uh, at least they don't have the the national tour going on. Also. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Like last time. Too. Which uh, that, is what that happened first last year. Lit, though, dude. So we got like. Indeed. We got a. Uh, Kiyaki Zaka, and then like, two people that we'll be seeing soon. Oh. We got yes. Enslo, we got Tanaka Yasutaka just recently announced for Anime Ooh. Expo. It's gonna be lit, my friends. So, so oh. maybe, maybe that that means they might bring Kayaki Zaka over. <laughs> <laughs> this equals this, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's just gonna be the Rock in Japan Day One lineup, dude. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. They're they're performing on the fourth of August, which I forgot to say earlier. It's the very first day. Mm. So, I. Uh, I, I've always wanted to go to rock in Japan. Like back then, there was only rock bands, but like recently, they've expanded Ex to include even idols. So that's pretty cool. Mm. Well, Kiyaki Zaka mm -hmm. definitely fits that that image, right? Mm -hmm. And then we got Beach. That that I mean, that's like those two make sense. And then like NGT Forty Eight. I'm like, hmm, wait, who? Pa pause a second. Wait, who? Oh, who that? Nugget number. Oh, you're gonna be cursed, man. <laughs> you're gonna be cursed. What a curse has transferred to Jimmy. Oh. <laughs> anyway, let's move on to One Chan. Nogizaka 46 has their uh, Sailor Moon musical. It started finally. Mm hmm. Uh huh. And, and it, uh, it's only for like, a, for like a certain number of weeks, and then they're gonna stop and then do it again later on, right? Something yeah, like later on, I think in September, I think they're gonna yeah. continue with, with more. So the first stage was uh, performed by Team Moon, which has Mizuk Yamashita as Sailor Moon. Mm -hmm. And uh, have, have you seen clips of this? I've only, I've only seen, seen the, the pictures. Yeah, pictures. Oh, you don't want to hear Yamashita singing then? Uh, oh, is it bad? So good. <laughs> I mean. Like we said, like you know, I don't, I don't, you know, no one typically follows idols only for talents. They have other charms mm -hmm. and stuff like mm -hmm. that too, <laughs> like playing, like playing you, like she's good at, you know. Yeah, yeah, I, that's that's why I like Mizaki, dude. I, I like her because every time I see her, in my, the back of my head, I have the thought, she knows what she's doing. Mm. <laughs> so by singing bad, you're saying uh, she knows she, what she's she doing. knows what she's doing. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I like how the cat is just a, a person. It's just a person controlling. It's not like an actual actor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just like a puppet, dude. Uh, what, I, what, I, what I don't like is that he's not even um, like in one of those all black lycra suits. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's just a guy like dressed up as a crew member with like a little like, cap on just <laughs> uh. playing with a stuffed cat. <laughs> so apparently it's not well received. <laughs> I mean, you're like, what? What? It's so bad. This is what happens when you choose uh, not Ikuta Erika to star in anything. <laughs> oh man, she does sound terrible. Holy shit. <laughs> the reaction faces. <laughs> where's, the, where's the what face? Everyone there in the chat, is. can we do a, Can we get a what face? What face? <laughs> oh, I'm going. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty bad. <laughs> was pretty bad. <laughs> mm. uh, I feel like the ladies in the little talking bubbles in the video just looking like, at oh, us. Like, oh, uh, there you go. What yeah. face? What face in the chat? That's 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 <laughs> nice. Woo! Yeah, that's good of her. Hopefully, a uh, team. What's the other team? Team Star. Right. But I will agree, she does team look Star good. 
She, I think they went for looks more more than anything, right? They went with the name, dude. They're like her name. Oh, is that's beautiful. Awesome. Yeah, that's, that's, that's too perfect. Uh-huh. <laughs> and then they then they showed up to the first day of rehearsals, uh-huh. and they're like, Ugh. <laughs> exactly. Oh, Desert Raven Gamer, thank you for that subscription. Thank you for the subscription. Um, uh, yep. Good looks, terrible singing. I don't know if Sayunyan is any better. Uh, no, no, she does sing. She does sing. Remember Forty Six Hour TV? I oh, you guys. Oh, I don't. I don't remember, remember anything. Remember, if you remember for the recap, you'll be able to see. Okay, so maybe Team Star is better than Team Moon. Uh, at least uh, we know Sayunyan is better. Thank you. Sayunyan is one of my favorites. And as we expected, Shirai Shimai is a, uh, a she VTR. appears on yeah she is on a screen. So yeah. they have like this big prismatic looking like mirror thing, and they're like, "Oh, my Yan. you know, she's there. She she didn't come in like, like quite like Tupac though. No, no, it wasn't a hologram. <laughs> yeah. but... mm-hmm. So she probably took those pictures, recorded that day, and then said, "I'm done." Yeah. She yeah. also ain't dead, so we'll let her slide. Yeah, yeah. What? Because uh, uh, the, the the Tupac hologram, right? Is that? What oh, you're... okay, okay, okay. Tu- Tupac is. You know, I, I kind of wish I never watched a video. Now uh, it's uh, ruined. Yeah, yeah, because all the pictures and stuff, everyone looks great. I'm like, oh, look, <laughs> oh, look at, look at cute little, little thick Itoriria, dude, you know, like, <laughs> this, what? This chubby cheeks, dude. What? Mm. Like, what? Kazumin has, a uh, wait, as Mars. Wait, what? So good. <laughs> oh, no. You're uh, telling me she can't... isn't? Dude, she's a cute little chubby kid, dude. <laughs> you said you said dick, dude. You're saying she's not? I'm saying that she's not of age to where I would call okay, her. Okay, I, I wouldn't be like, thick. I don't know, you kind of did, you kind of did. <laughs> it, it, Kaz looks good, I'm going to move this along. Uh, you know... <laughs> I'm trying to say like she's, I, she's I know, blunt, but it's like not an unattractive I, I, one. I, you know? I know what you're saying. I can, <laughs> I can see that. Uh, you know, Umezao looks good. Mm-hmm. Oh, there isn't actually any pictures of her <laughs> performing because it's just the team moon. Uh, but I'll, I know, I, you know what I mean. Anyway, hopefully the Sailor Moon musical will also be broadcast on TV after it's done. No, mm-hmm. please don't. But probably <laughs> the other version, <laughs> uh, or the last, the last la- one later on in September when we've all forgotten about it, mm. and they just broadcast Team Star because hopefully they're better. They need to do what the the Ooh. other group does for um. Oh, Tron with the donate, thank you, bud. Um, oh, thank they you. They need to do what the other group does with uh. Their, Jimmy, um, are all the emotes Jarena? Uh, no, ah, dude. the ones I set are. Anyways, <laughs> so, so the ones that get used the most. <laughs> Anyways, they need to do. Dude, with we're the... a we're a Sakamichi series podcast right now. Like, all the, all the... <laughs> Look, it's yeah, all you, wrong. You guys, you guys could have changed it. No one did it. It's all wrong, my friend. Uh, anyway, go ahead. What were you gonna say? They need to do what the other group does with uh, their uh, their own Kohaku performance. You know, where they just oh, go back yes. in and they just re-record everything. <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, let's let's go back let's hit up the recording studio let's re-sing everything you know mm. and then the, uh, you, you can broadcast that version they could have at least used a backing track like just lip singing pop star nowadays no i mean like they're still singing it but there's a backing track oh okay also playing mm-hmm. you know what i mean so yes that is that. Unfortunately, it, it was terrible. Oh. Hopefully, by the last performance, she, she gets better. <laughs> it's tolerable. Oh, see, that's the appeal. Like, by the end of the actual run of this music. She knows what she's doing. Maybe that's she's saying that on purpose. That's what are for, guys. Jeez. She's going to be, like, so good. And it was going to be, like, oh, She did wow. on purpose, Jimmy. Jimmy, oh. you already know. You already know. She did she on purpose. She knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing. She's singing bad on purpose. That way, at the end, she could be really good. And people are like, oh, look how much she's improved. Super and she gets that center position. That is amazing. That's what... Japanese idols are all about mm-hmm. that growth and development. You uh, sit through the the terrible singing and performing in their early years, and by mm-hmm. the time they graduate, 
They're a little better. <laughs> They're slightly better. Mm -hmm. So let's move on to more news and mm -hmm. current events. Uh, both Nogizaka and Keakizaka have released statements or notices mm -hmm. telling fans to stop stalking the girls, man. <laughs> God damn. Come on, Jimmy. Stop, stop talking. He told you, yeah. Come on. Josh Box. What do you have to say band, for yourself? Like, following them after I mean, handshake events or like following the the van that they're riding in like shit guys i see the way jimmy looks at Ito Ridia. Oh my all right God. let's let's not start any <laughs> dangerous rumors all right <laughs> look look you know, just... things on social media spread like wildfire you don't want to de deface jimmy <laughs> i'll bring, jimmy like I'll that, bring this whole group down with me watch me <laughs> Anyway, you already, you already ru ruined my whole shoot. <laughs> they, there have been reports of people <laughs> looking for mm. addresses of certain members mm. and such. Uh, it's not, it's not even, uh, you know, just Sakamichi series, right? The other group mm -hmm. has had a few issues like this. You know, going to Google, typing in Shirashimai, whatever address, addresses you know. in Japanese. <laughs> Something uh, shoe, right? So yeah, you guys, you guys. Got so, you know, like a few months we gotta stop back, Jimmy. Shida Manaka wrote a blog post about being uncomfortable because people be following her and shit. Mm -hmm. um, it's not even, I, I wouldn't even say it's like creepy, like stalking, like, you know, it's just people following her, right? Like, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. When they probably you know, see like her they wanna, in public or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Right? That kind of thing, right? She's just walking around the town kind of like, I want to I wanna go buy ice cream or some mm -hmm. shit. And then, this, this is a weird guy following me all the way. Like, yeah, someone's following her from the mm. back. It doesn't mean this like, confrontation, right? Yeah, but that's still kind of, like, what? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it's just, you know what, like, I, 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 I say there's only two options if you ever notice an idol out on the streets, right? Mm. Like, if you, either you gauge it as, like, it's like a, they're out in the public and they're they're, like, they don't want to be bothered. Yeah, well, something. if they're like, they look like they're like okay with it, then mm -hmm. sure. But if they're not, then you just leave it at that. And if you're unsure, then just err on the side of safety and just leave it at that and respect their privacy. You know. Yeah. yeah. But is that more of a Western culture thinking? Or I think it is because over here, I think we'd probably say hi, right? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Oh, yeah. hey, you're you're yeah. whatever. What's up? Uh, and oh, you like, should actually on, Yeah, and then be on our way, right? But like, yeah, I guess we the fans like, stay over there. there. Yeah. The fans yeah. over there, they'll actually, like, they won't acknowledge that it's Shida Manaka or whatever, right? They, yeah, they'll just keep following. They won't following. say hi, but they'll, like, keep following her or something. Yeah. yeah Maybe take that, pictures. I feel like that's worse, though, you know? like. Yeah, I know. that. Yeah, I feel that way, too. Because at least the hi is, like, one and done. Right? Mm -hmm. Like, you're yeah. they'll probably be like, oh, cool. Someone You've acknowledged, this. they've acknowledged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go your own way. Huh? Yeah. So, ugh. I mean, I, I get that there's, like, cultural disparities, but if, that, if that's, like, the case, I just, like... All the more, then just don't, just just leave them alone, you know? Mm. Like, if, if you're really blaming that, like, the, the whole, like, uh, well, you know, they just don't really say hi to people, right? Because, mm. like, in that case, following around someone is, like, completely <laughs> inappropriate, you know? Mm. Mm. I, I think that, the, yeah. the weird thing is, like, they would actually follow the, like, the company vans and shit, like, <laughs> right? Like, it, it's, it says that on the, on the post, Mm. And it's like, what the heck? Mm. But, uh, see, and y'all be complaining about not seeing 21 member Kiyakizaka, man. Stop, stop stalking them, man. Maybe they'll <laughs> come back as 21 members. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you sent Shida Monica out to the arms of a of a, another guy for this? <laughs> <laughs> a bunch of creeps. Yeah, mm. dude, it's... Uh... Yeah, because you have to be at a certain level where you start stalking people. Like, it isn't just, like, the regular person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, it, it's so hard because I, I feel like to these people, they don't see it as stalking, right? I think they see what yeah, they're doing as mm -hmm, harmless. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's a lot of, like, uh, I don't want to call them fans, but, like, the, the sesang and, like, K-pop groups, right? The people that full-on mm -hmm. hire, like, like, what is it? They're like, yeah, they'll, they'll chase the company vans and stuff like that just to follow the group. And it's just like... They, not not even to like do anything, but just to be in the presence, you know, like, mm -hmm. like they're 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 like private driving taxis that will like specifically drive recklessly so they can like catch up because but then they'll like 
charge exorbitant amounts for these people and stuff like that. Hey guys, I thought of a new business idea for Japan. <laughs> no, we're not doing it, Mr. Box, all right? <laughs> but like, you know, I, I feel like maybe maybe it's like a younger people thing where it's just like, I mean, I don't want to blame it on you, but like, you know, like the kind of like, yeah, it's like you, you get so attached to these idol groups that you forget that like, yeah, they're, they're people. Yeah. We're getting as bad as K-pop fans, guys. Oh no! Yeah, dude, <laughs> Come on, guys. We're better than this, dude. Uh, anyway. Yeah. Hopefully, we see Twenty One Member Kekizaka performance <laughs> soon. One day. They, they nerfed One day. My One, group, day. One day. They, they they wish Goku back into a child. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Uh, anyway, let's keep going here. Uh, <laughs> the last bit of news Ooh, for current events, right? Because they're. I have an really... update on someone, by the way. Okay. Well, what's we well, doing with this? Well, okay. Hmm. The Nogisatsu photo book. Mm-hmm. Any of you getting it? Of course I am. The Twitter convinced me, dude. Yeah, dude. All these. <laughs> they they have printed to like it was reported that they've printed two hundred and eighty thousand copies. Mm-hmm. It's not. A, it comes out what? Yeah, just on month? that pre-order. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, just pre-order. pre-order. So high because their Twitter game is so on point with all these fan service videos. My goodness. Mm-hmm. I will package that with the Sugai photo book because I forgot to get it. <laughs> and so. Mm-hmm. Oh yes. Uh huh. It'll, it'll, I mean, I'm just buying it because of their Twitter. They did, you know, they, that's the only reason yeah twitter's probably like ha got him so yeah indeed I can, you I can, did i can't wait for the the joshua box photo book review on this one where you like oh it's like oh they should have really used some better lighting here you know, uh, <laughs> um, you know this is awful this, this it's not even in focus off. why would you why would you crop her there uh you know you're, you're missing part of horimiona's shoulder that you know just kind of weird uh it's awful it doesn't have like himoto manatsu in it <laughs> <laughs> just gonna yeah. pray like oh you know what you could really tell Manatsu took this photo it really has like that, that air of professionalism you know look at look at look at that shallow depth of field but that tack sharp focus on the eyes you know Manatsu's really got it going mm. in the end I'll give it a 4 out of 10 because it barely has any Manatsu she four took most of the photos <laughs> two, two out of she 10 she wasn't in them because it didn't say Zukun when I opened it up Zukun <laughs> you know, like a pop up book with her like fingers <laughs> That, no, that's a good idea. <laughs> there you go, Josh. You can make that book. <laughs> no, I, I actually really like um, behind the scene photo books. Me like, too, man. Yeah, yeah. It's like obviously it's not for like uh, the professional grade look, right? But it's like mm. I, I feel like the expressions you get, you're only gonna get in like these kinds of photo books, right? It's like yeah, I mean, like you buy it for the behind the scenes photos, right? Mm-hmm. Like uh. Not you know. because it's of its artistic quality in the, the photography yeah. and stuff. Uh, you're not so. you're not gonna get you know like Sai Ringo and Mayan being gay on like any professional photo book. Uh, I mean, course. maybe I don't know. Maybe, well, what was that? maybe like was a magazine. Like a ha, you know? Maybe like a magazine. But it's like mm. different though. It's a very staged gay. You know what I mean? Mm. It's not like them backstage just like oh, come <laughs> come my lover. <laughs> Well, I think that's uh, a lot of fee- people or a lot of fans want to see this kind of stuff, right? Because we we rarely get a get a sight into what they do behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's always a fun thing to have. So for uh, sure, I- I'm buying it. Thank you, Nogi. That's a Twitter. Mm-hmm. All the, all those freaking uh, chin chin pictures uh, videos, dude. You got yeah, me. dude. Mm-hmm. But like, they've been putting more stuff oh god don't you're not even in the same <laughs> oh wait, wait no it has to be me it has to be me it has to be me oh, damn it here, here, here you go jimmy come on come on jimmy come on jimmy oh, oh my god <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> well this this i think this book actually has uh re- re- i want to say like replayability what's the word <laughs> i'll look at it more than once Oh, okay. You know, unlike most photo books where I just like... I'm going to say replay value, but I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> you know, or like I look through a photo book once and I put it away and I'm like, yep, 
that's a good one. <laughs> and I never look at it ever again. Really? I look at them I look at them once in a while. Well that's because you're a lewd boy, dude. <laughs> that's not why I look at we them. all know that Josh Box at the end of a long hard day just closes a door, dims a light, gets a, gets a nice cup of coffee, and pulls out Dosuru, you know? <laughs> There's Recital photo book. That one's right here. So yes, please support Nogisatsu. Uh, mm-hmm. and, and buy this book. It will be released on the 26th of June. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And, mm-hmm. uh, yeah. Yeah, we're all it. picking it up, so... Yeah, well, yeah. well, why don't we get together and do a group review? Ooh, that's a fun one. Let's... All right, we're, we're calling it now. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll make the drive. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we'll do that. Now, Josh, what did you have? An so I, remember, I remember how last week we talked about Kageyama? Kageyama Yuka, yes. And how she's going to school, so she's going to be a hiatus. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Well, it seems like uh, we have like sort of an estimated time how long that'll take. Two years. And apparently it won't be for a while, because apparently she wants to be firmly in school and be doing good before she joins back in the group. I'll so she wants to see her again. She, she wants to do the exam, pass the exam, and go into the school and then like have good grades in order to go back. That is... At least from what I've heard. <laughs> okay, see, I'm gonna I'm compare never this gonna to... I'm gonna dance again. I'm gonna compare this to another... Uh, let me go ahead and compare this to another uh, idol group called Cheeky Parade. Mm. Oh, God, no! <laughs> no! Um, so two uh, two members of the group, they, they left for school for mm. two years. Mm. And then, you know, they, they have finished... They're schooling after two years. And you know what happens? What's happening to Cheeky Parade? They're disbanding. <laughs> Goodbye, They're Hiragana Kiyakizaka. Kiyakizaka. <laughs> I'll see you later. That's why you support Kanji Kiyakizaka. Please, uh, <laughs> please support Kanji. They're not even all there. Just like Hiragana. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, they, they notice Hiragana getting too strong now. So, like, we gotta nerf them now, too, guys. <laughs> we gotta nerf them. <laughs> Kagama, you wanna go to the World Cup? Oh. oh. Sure. Hey, you want a one-way trip to a good university? Oh. Well, I mean, good for her. She's prioritizing what she should, right? Like, mm-hmm. you wanna go to school and be successful, you know? it's Being an idol isn't really a... Uh, you never know what's gonna happen, right? Mm-hmm. Could be good, yeah. could be bad. Never know. Mm-hmm. Depends what cards management gives you. Yeah, so... For sure. not, we don't even get 21 member Hiragana Kiyaki performance. So, oof, there you go. There you that's go. That's a tough one. Yeah, you don't get either. Uh, Support uh, Nogizaka. <laughs> Kichan is back now. Oh, yeah. That's someone who was on hiatus and came back. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Jimmy's having another conversation with chat. <laughs> um, yes. How about so... Cheeky Parade, dude? Because I miss him so much. <laughs> I'll be back just to disband, Jimmy. It's okay. (laughs) Any other updates, Josh, that you have Uh, for us? I think that's it. All right. All right. All right. That does it for current events. And now on to the weather. Hot. Jimmy? It's very hot in Southern (laughs) California. Mm. All right. And now to Boy with the TV show roundup. (laughs) All right. Thank you, Jimmy. To the TV show roundup. It's a little light this week. Mm-hmm. Because two shows did not air mm-hmm. because of tennis, I think. There was like a tennis. It's, it's usually because of tennis. Right, it's tennis. tennis. Once again with the tennis. And mm-hmm. so we only have uh, like Kira Bingo, Nogi Zaka Kojichu, but we did have Nogi Nogi. Eyo this week. Mm-hmm. And so Kira Bingo. Ta-da. It's the self dokiri, as in dokiri. They set up themselves and not, you know, thought up by the show's producers. Mm-hmm. Um, Bemi Holders first with her self dokiri. She was like, "I will prank Nibu because Jimmy didn't pick me." And so her <laughs> prank was that she she will hear creepy voices, you know, just like that show monitoring, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and like react to stuff. But Nibu doesn't hear it, obviously. There were like a few of them in on the joke. Uh-huh. And she acts like she passes out, like the ghost has taken her. 
Uh-huh. And Neeb was freaking out like, yo, what is going uh-huh. on? And then someone else passes out. Like yeah. my poor sweet child. And, and Neeb was like freaking out. And then mm-hmm. Bimiho wakes up uh, like a zombie. And she's like, ah, got him. <laughs> and, and that was the and that was, that was the prank. Uh-huh. What'd you think, Jimmy? Um, I'm sorry, Bimiho. <laughs> if you guys could just please get along. It would make me so happy. Mm, it's, it's silly for that. What's next? <laughs> Next was Takamoto Ayaka's prank. And it was oh, dead. the best kind of prank, dude. And that was to be kind of gay. Mm. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> anyway, she's at, like, Kumi's place. And she just has, like, a phone. Like, a selfie. Like, Bemiho's phone was, like, hidden, right? Mm. Takamoto just, like, shows up. And with she's the phone. Like, she's, like, with Kumi. Kumi's doing her own thing. She's mm. like, yo, what's up? She's like, oh, say, say, like, ten things you like about me. So, like, she's going through, like, the things. But she only says seven. And it's like, that's it? I was like, yeah, uh, yeah. Anyway, it's, it's just a prank, bro. Ha. 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 Right, right, right. Ha. And Kumi's like, uh, okay, okay. And she's like, okay, I'm going to go to the next person. And she goes to Mire. And Mire's sitting at the table. She's, like, tearing apart tissues for some reason. For some reason, yeah. What a weirdo. But Mire was like, uh, ten things? Okay, yeah. Like, uh, how about your nose? Your hair? And like your eyes, <laughs> just like small things. She's like, okay, that was quick. Do another ten. And Mira's like, uh, okay. And she's like, oh. <laughs> by the way, it's just a, it's just a prank, bro. <laughs> <And> <laughs> got got him. She, got got him. I don't know. And then she also does it to Takase Mana. And Takase just like lists off more than twenty things. Really. Yeah. It's like, she's okay, like, okay, haha. It was a, it was a prank, bro. <laughs> and so they go back to the studio, and Sandwich Sandwich Man's like, the hell are you trying to show us right there? Like what? <laughs> what the heck is this? She was like, "Oh, my bad, dude. It's just trying to make it a." It was a just prank, a prank. <laughs> but it ended up being just like people praising me and stuff. My bad. <laughs> anyway, the next <laughs> prank, prank was, was Ushio, and Ushio just doing the classic like scare prank when people, not, you know, just out of nowhere kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Jump scare, so, jump scares, dude. So she's talking to Kakizaki, and then someone like jumps at her. Same thing with Mirei. Mm-hmm. It was cute. Mm-hmm. Nice little like, watch. Like Kumi came and scared Mirei, but Kumi mm-hmm. actually like pushes her. Yeah, she, like, the falls floor. to the floor. <laughs> like, but then she's sca- violent, like, dude. Like Mirei like screams all loud, but then like oh shoot, shh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and they go back to the studio, and then like Katoshi scares Ushio. Oh, mm-hmm. got you back, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the next prank was from Pari Pichan, and she was like, "Ha oh, look at these like." clips i got of these girls doing gags how embarrassing got him <laughs> got him i mm. guess and they were just like man she was kind of annoying with the thing so I, we did it because she so she would stop asking <laughs> uh, anyway like the last prank was from kumi and she actually got like the show's producers to help her mm. and uh this happened after the the ikemen thing Cause she was dressed up as the charai dude, mm-hmm. and so it was with the help of the, of the wrestling, the pro wrestler from the first episode that scared all the people. Mm-hmm. And so, uh, Kumi's in the back just watching. So Katoshi is in the room, and the wrestler is hiding in the locker. She like bursts out, but there's like no reaction. She's just like, <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> but then, the 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 pro wrestler ends up asking her how to like dance some of the songs <laughs> yeah <laughs> they're without like, explaining she's over there dancing with her <laughs> yeah and so the next person was hamigishi who got really scared of the pro wrestler mm-hmm. and like she bursts out of the the, the locker and it's like hey uh i've been thinking of like doing more wrestling stuff can you like tell me how, how it looks you think <laughs> yeah. and like another pro wrestler comes in and they mm. start wrestling in the room which mm. is <laughs> She's in the background of the Yeah, she's just standing like, uh, what? <laughs> so, like, the pro, like, they're actually doing, like, wrestling moves. She, like, slams mm-hmm. her on the floor. Yeah. And it's like a concrete floor. Uh-huh. Damn, so, like, damn, <laughs> Not dude. even a mat, dude. Taking that bump. Uh, the last person was Iguch. You know, the same thing. But then Iguch acts out one of the, the Ikemen skits for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> it was so dumb. But anyway, that mm-hmm. was the prank. It was just a prank, bro. Mm-hmm. Tokiri Daiseiko. G- mm-hmm. Got him. Which mm-hmm. one was your favorite, Josh? Uh, 
probably the last one. Because uh, it was Kumis, of course. But, right? Baby Close was pretty good too, though. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I feel like if they had more production value, they could have made that funnier. Yeah. Like maybe but, they actually had noises. Oh, but that was. That, then that would just straight have been monitoring, right? Like. No, yeah. oh, I guess you're right, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, that was the. The whole episode. Well, there's Kea Room, which I never watch. Next week on Kea Bingo, Matsuda plays some guitar. And Kyoko shows a B costume. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh. Maybe it's like their special skill type of thing. <laughs> Your special skill is being like a honey. B costume. I look good in it. <laughs> Meow, yes. ah, he <laughs> that, that, if, if that's true, <laughs> that should be like the definition of Japanese idol. Just show a picture of her in a B costume. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Iguchi's ideal skill. ideal costume. I mean, not <laughs> ideal idol. Hiragano, she did not air because mm-hmm. of tennis. Keiaki Tekake and I did not air because of tennis. So mm-hmm. we go to Nogi Chu, my dudes. Mm-hmm. And so it's the bargaining battle, which was fairly interesting. Uh, they, they had two choices, mm-hmm. A or B. And it, like the, mi- the minority pick wins, wins, right? Mm-hmm. And so the, the theme was the, I would not hold this in my hand. And it's either a scorpion or a frog. Mm-hmm. Um, and so the players were Shirai Shimai. Matsumura, Sakurai Inoue, Nakadakana, Wadamaya, and Kawago. Okay, w- real quick. Everyone has their has their thing, right? Mm-hmm. Jimmy, you have yours? Yes. Okay, so so face side is A, this is B. A is scorpion, B is frog. Wait, wait, okay, okay wait. Face side is A. Yes. Okay, and scorpion. then face side is B. Okay, B. okay so, so, so let's vote. Which one would you not want to pick up? So, one, two... Three. <laughs> we all went ahead and touch it. <laughs> we all picked the frog. Right? Yeah, we, we all picked the frog. Touch dude, the frog. I'll, I'll kill me. <laughs> so, so, so that means we w- all would have had to touch the frog. No, B is the frog. Which yeah, is B is the frog. To touch. Yeah. Oh, so wait, we all, wait. So we all would have picked the frog. Oh wait, I, I don't, I don't want to pick up the frog. So should have been. Oh yeah. A. So you pick A. Yeah. So Jimmy would be the one who doesn't touch anything. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. the worst. And then, and then it'd be us too. For variety. That's right. Uh, and so they had three times they could change their their pick. Uh, the first time was just you know just like how we just did it. Like, mm-hmm. would you or would you not without seeing either the frog yeah, yeah. or the scorpion? And I like so, how a couple of them are like, I never even seen a scorpion. I don't even know what a scorpion looks like. Yeah, like, they gave their reasoning, you know. Mm-hmm. Like oh, I didn't like you know scorpions have so many legs or the, mm-hmm. the frogs like all like wet or whatever you know stuff mm-hmm. like that. Was it Maya who said that? Oh no, it was a Kago who said. I imagine it looks like a like a shrimp or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the scorpion. Uh-huh. You know, there's a lot of like a lot of legs, probably mm-hmm. like a shrimp. Mm-hmm. And so the second time, poisonous man. They they mm-hmm. choose again after seeing the frog and the scorpion, mm-hmm. and the scorpions are huge, dude. They're mm-hmm. like this long and shit, like. Mm-mm. They're he- like the huge, huge, yeah. huge scorpions. But... And then how everyone reacts and everything. <laughs> that's when everyone reacts. Uh, the frog uh-huh. was fairly large too, mm-hmm. but I feel like, was like that's the same frog in every frog. other idol variety show that's been. <laughs> same frog. <laughs> it just he has looks years like of experience. Frog. He's their senpai. <laughs> no, he's he's back. Like ah, here we go again. Right, it's the idols again. Time time to get dropped a lot. <sighs> Yeah, so they, they a few of them changed their their picks. Like, mm. uh, on second thought, after seeing this, I don't mm-hmm. know. Mm. Frog looks all slimy and stuff. Uh, yeah. yeah. So uh, um, I I've just started being able to kill spiders myself, like <laughs> like a year ago. <laughs> so uh, uh, the scorpion, good on you, friend. The scorpion's no go for me. You know. <laughs> yeah. One like day I'm gonna make you eat a scorpion. It's like a big spider, and I have to use like a tissue because that's the only thing. And like I crush it, and then like a leg still is like I can see it like out from. Oh, oh. But at least you know the the bigger the spider, the the less poisonous, right? Like tarantulas mm. aren't poisonous, but yeah. they're huge. But it, it's more of like it's like a it's like a like an irrational fear, mm. right? Ah, uh, of course. Yes. It's like when we went to Six Flags and I can't ride roller coasters, you know. 
Like, I know they're safe, but I'm Why still terrified. Why even go to Six Flags <laughs> if you can't ride roller coasters? But I rode them, though. Oh, I, right. I, I manned up. You, you right, you right, you manned up. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, the third time they can change their, their pick mm-hmm. is after the bargaining. They're actually like, trying to get girls to pick what they want to pick so that mm-hmm. they can double-cross them at the end kind of thing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And so Maya is like, please, I don't really want to touch the frog can we all pick b and she's like trying to get everyone to pick b yes so she picks a yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's funny because think... she's, she's like she's like tries to understand the situation she's yeah. like i don't get it but everyone pick b okay that way i don't touch the frog <laughs> please pick b guys yeah. please pick b and it's like okay because <laughs> the, the three on the very left like mayan Siringo, and reika they all pick the same thing, right? But like mm. when Maya was talking to them, they're like, "Yeah, yeah, sure, of course, we'll pick B." Mm. But like you can see it in their face, they're like, "Hell no, dude!" We're yeah. gonna pick B. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but in the end, everyone picks B except mm. Nakarakana. Yeah, she was she outsmarted everyone. Got him. <laughs> I, I, I think it was the final comment she said. So she said at the end, "So if everyone picks B." That means A will be in the minority. She says that and then leaves it like that. So then everybody thinks, "Oh, if I switch it." Yeah. Then I'll be in the minority, but then everybody will try to do it, I so think, I should switch with the other one. Like, I think in the end, Maya was going to pick A, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, but then she picked B anyway for some reason. Yeah, yeah. That's, she was like, <laughs> well, I thought you were going to pick A, dude. what the hell? <laughs> Trying to play the mind games. But uh, yeah, she wins technically, or loses? Depending on if, you you know, it's variety. She, she wins? Loses. No, loses? Because she doesn't get that much screen time? Yeah, and technically she loses because she doesn't want you know she doesn't get screen time, but she mm-hmm. wins the actual game. Not, not touching, touching the animal gross. because she doesn't yeah. have to touch anything. Mm-hmm. What's your take on it? I don't know. <laughs> as a viewer, I guess she loses, but as an idol, she wins. Yeah. Mm. Anyway, Shiraishimai has to go first. Uh huh. So you gotta touch the frog first, uh-huh. my aunt. It's like Himura. He's like picking up the frog, right? Mm-hmm. And they, they're like, oh, look, Kimura is also a frog because he looks like one. And my, my hand's just like <laughs> floundering about, like, oh, shit, what should I do, man? Oh, 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 know, hold oh, hold on. No, oh, no. <laughs> it's so funny, like, when she puts her, her hands on the table, mm-hmm. but like she pulls it away and she like can't process what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> it's my hand milking her screen time there. Mm-hmm. Very, very good. good uh-huh. job. The original, she knows what she's doing. Uh-huh. But she's also been like historically afraid of the frogs, you know, weird animals, right? Uh-huh. Like that the snake, snake, yeah. Mm-hmm. And like when they went to the reptile shop, that one. Oh yeah, uh-huh. she's like, right, <laughs> stuff like that. It's, uh, it's it's usually pretty funny. I think they were the Yankee episode. They did something like that, didn't they? Yeah, back in Tenoko. It's been a while. So. Yeah. Um. Anyway, yeah, she takes forever to touch the frog they even <laughs> cut to a commercial before she touches the frog uh, so she has to hold the frog on her, in her hand for like five seconds mm. and then like they can't like you know she holds it for five seconds and like tries to run away to wipe her mm. hands but she starts like wait hold on what's your comments uh-huh. we need some comments here and she's all like oh, it's gross <laughs> uh, <laughs> like how did it feel like oh, it was so like disgusting and stuff like this <laughs> Anyway, they go through the other girls, and they're mm-hmm. also entertaining, right? Mm-hmm. Same thing with Matsumura. She's like, Shitara-san, hold my arms! Because she like, oh, yeah. keeps pulling him back. <laughs> so he's like holding her yeah. while they put the frog in her hands. <laughs> it was pretty funny. Kawago is uh, pretty funny, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she, she, went the, she went the extra mile. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, wait, you only held him for four seconds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was, that, was, uh, that was a funny moment the mm-hmm, episode mm-hmm. paid off i think mm-hmm. in that way and what's so, the what's next episode the next episode they might touch the scorpions who knows oh they're gonna play it again with different people i don't know because they're they're like the same people are sitting in the seats <laughs> uh-huh. it's like how about round two guys oh. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> let's God. see what you touch now yeah so right. and that's oh, the and they also of, co- what, didn't what, they call Inoue cute like didn't she thought call Inoue cute or something like that Oh, she was like, oh, the frog is cute. Uh-huh. She thought I was like, oh, you're cute. <laughs> <laughs> she was, though. Like, uh-huh. like, she was all quiet and stuff, touching the frog. Mm-hmm. Ah, there's, you know, Sailor Moon. Ah. Mm-hmm. May you be better than Mizuk. Please. 
<laughs> I'll show you producers for picking a girl f- for her name. <laughs> ah. mm. That's Nogichu. Mm-hmm. We also had Nogiego. Mm-hmm. And, Return uh, to Hawaii. Mm-hmm. Part two. Yeah. And now on to Nogiego with Josh. Did you not watch it, boy? Uh, I watched it earlier, but I kind of wa- I wasn't really paying attention. Okay. Uh, this is part two of No Diego. Uh, really simple stuff that they did. Um, I think it's just watching their interactions with the people that makes this episode worth it. It's not so much like narratively that happens, but just like seeing how they how they react to everything in English is funny. Mm. Um, first, they go to a juice shop. They try to guess all the flavors inside of the drink. Yeah, those things. Like I used to go to those cold press juice places, right? And they're fairly healthy, right? The green juices and whatnot. Jimmy, what are you doing? Sorry, I'll but they're like. Seconds. Give it a second. They're like eight bucks for a bottle, and I'm like, bruh. Mm. No, thank you. Just squeeze your own fruit, right? Right. I'll, I'll do my own. And then afterwards, uh, they see people. I think I don't know if it's in the same shop. I forgot, but they invite people to go to their barbecue later today. So they're like, <laughs> oh hey, uh, do you want to like you know uh, a come barbecue? And like half the time, the girls don't understand them. They're just like, uh, what? That was so <laughs> weird and awkward, dude. It's like, is that really like? Did they just come up come up on these like people eating and shit? Right? Because they were like, hey, oh that smells good. What are mm. you eating? And this, so, like, they started asking those girls about, it's like, where are you from and how old you mm-hmm. are and stuff. It's like, by the way, you want to come to a barbecue? I'm like, paid actors. <laughs> <laughs> well, didn't they make Kazumin do something like that once where she had to, like, make her own oh, yeah. party and then invite, like, oh, yeah, uh, yeah. owners mm-hmm. or something like that, mm-hmm. right? That was no Diego, right? No, that, that was, that was oh, Tedoko, no. right? No, that was Tedoko. Oh, yeah, I thought it was, they had... either, yeah, it was either Tedoko or Noji. Uh, I thought there was a Nogi Ego episode, but like m- the most of the people who came were like students, so they kind of knew Japanese too. Mm-hmm. Mm. Either or. Hopefully, they do that episode again when one of us are there. <laughs> but you know, if I was eating and and like. Oh, bunch, thank you, random girl, for inviting me to your party. Of, a bunch of Japanese girls came up and be like, "You want to come to a barbecue?" Yo, dude, I don't. Hell care. yeah! I don't care if it's like. <laughs> I'm just waiting to like wake up in a in like a, a bathtub with like just a bunch of ice cubes and a missing kidney. Like uh-huh. if Reka if Reka's there, you would say no to someone uh, who looks like Sakurai Reka. No, that's what I'm saying. I'd go. I'm just saying like I, even knowing that like I'm gonna get like chopped up, <laughs> my organs are gonna be sold on the black market. I'm like, well, if she's asking me, I gotta go. She's hey, you wanna come to bar? I'll fuck my shit up, fam. I'm, let's go. <laughs> Let go. Oh, we got ribs. Go. I'm there. <laughs> Those are the, the two R's, dude. Reka and ribs, dude. I'm good. <laughs> but anyway. Anyway, uh, they successfully ask them and they say yes. Uh, later, we'll see them on. Um, then they go see some dolphins. Uh, they kiss mm. the dolphins. Um, Lucky dolphins. And, and then the dolphins carry them with their arms to the water. Lucky dolphins. <laughs> and then the dolphins make swoop them up from under and then they stand on the dolphins and then they fall over and, and flop onto the water lucky dolphins <laughs> lucky and dolphins i can't swim but if i could i would i would go also to an aquarium aquarium and, and try that shit out that seemed fun dude you don't really have to swim right how, how deep is it to, to do that i mean just in case that's true. That's true. I, don't I, mean, I, look would, like I would a rather fool, to be able to than not. But. I don't want to look like an idiot in front of the dolphins, you know. Like, What's up with this dude? You can't oh, even swim you know, trying to play with us? Too. They're, they're going to laugh at you, dude. Right. Like, this, this fool trying to roll with us, he can't even swim. What the hell? Bro, get, get, get back on land with here, that what? shit, dude. Cut that two-leg shit out of here, dude. Right, get out Fins here. all day, bro. <laughs> the, uh, the instructor, uh, why was she saying San... Nino, then Ichi. And sometimes they count like, like then they say the no with me. Well, I hear like, uh, I don't know. It's kind of. I, I, I don't know what you're talking about. I have to. She does say n- no, 
Yeah, she, she says she, like like she, she counts out from three to like the girls. So some of the dolphins come and soup her up. Usually it's like each no san hi kind of thing, right? Oh, so she, is that what she's trying to do? I don't know. I don't anyway, know Japanese. Anyway, I, I, uh, next I, I, thing I don't I have no idea what the context is, so I need to watch it. It's just counting down when the dolphins come and sweep from up. Maybe and it's then, just the, the instructor dolphins. who speaks English is saying like "san, ni no, ichi," and then it comes. Okay. Anyway, they go to the supermarket afterwards because you know they have to prepare for the barbecue party. Oh yeah, mm. gotta buy groceries. Uh, so when they walk in, first thing they see is cookies, and they're like, "Oh yeah, cookies," and they're like, "Yo, look at those M M&M and M cookies. Those are like American cookies right there." <laughs> <laughs> Straight up American, yeah. They're pretty, you know. They're big too. Mm-hmm. And then uh, Matsumura goes on the hunt for meat, and then she's like, "Oh, look at this big meat! This is my dreamland. This is America." Them steaks, dude. Mm-hmm. And then, and then she gets more distracted because she, she like they send her off to get something, and as she's walking by, she walks by the frozen aisle. She's like, "Oh, is this mango sherbet?" And he just gets it and brings it back to the shopping cart. So they're like what is this we didn't ask you to bring this yep I'll, I'll never understand how Ringo isn't like thick <laughs> you know what I mean that's it, what it, Jimmy Jimmy wishes Ringo could be thick like, please well, how she, can you eat so much rice and that's not what I'm saying dude. it's all carbs <laughs> how does she do it dude maybe she just eats that and then eats nothing for like a week yeah that's that's how she does it dude mm. Because I think she said before, like, sometimes she doesn't eat for, like, a day. You gotta keep Which isn't the healthiest thing to do. Shape. I mean, she is a model, too, so. Mm. Mm. She's gotta, right. yeah, probably to avoid that, like, bloat or whatever, but. Mm. Yeah. Still, though, man, like. Right? She's not, it's not even like she, like, eats a bunch of, like, vegetables and lean proteins. It's like. Let me get that rice, though. Ooh, let me ice rice with ice cream. Let me get that ice cream. Let me get some cookies, you know? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next, uh, they decided to cook the stuff they get from the store. And uh, Mai Chun does all the work. Oh, because um, she's a real adult. That's mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, Matsumura Holy just, just human being, dude. stands yeah. in the background and just goes like this. And then Sakurai just joins her <laughs> as she's cooking. See, and then... Uh, like, Jesus Christ, these children. This is and then... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, dude, but she can't say anything because they're senpai, dude. She's like, oh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh, that's uh-huh. right. Uh-huh. <laughs> and then, uh, and, and Sakurai tries to help out a little you know, on the grill because uh, Maichun made like a bacon wrapped asparagus. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, and then Rika like tries to flip it over, but she messes up all the bacon, so it's like all over the place. <laughs> bacon she, like, like unravels. Yeah, <laughs> she's oh, like no, Maichun, no. help. Dude, that's like <laughs> the worst thing to try to grill, dude. Because like. <laughs> You know, the, the bacon's going to cook way faster than this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's like, okay, the asparagus will, or the bacon will either come out burnt and the asparagus good, or you can get really hard asparagus with nice bacon on the outside. Mm. Mm. Gotta cook gotta cook the asparagus a little bit first, mm. then you wrap it, and then you throw that on the grill, you know what I mean? See, grill just, just throw it at the microwave. <laughs> Got a grill master over here. I'm fat, so you, you can trust me, I know. <laughs> He knows his bacons and asparaguses. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh, okay, so then um, girls try the meat. Like, like it barely gets out of out of the grill, and then they try it without Maichun looking. She's like, Maichun's gonna get mad at us. <laughs> uh, and then uh, the, uh, Sakurai and Matsumura decide to walk around since they're not helping. And then they find some people chilling outside, and they're like, "Hey, you want to join for the barbecue?" Oh, and they're like. Actors. They're like, oh, oh, yeah, sure, yeah. <laughs> Paid actors. <laughs> and then uh, the party starts from then on. It starts raining, though, so that was kind of yeah. lame. Uh-huh. They're, like, huddled up, like... Under an umbrella? We're, we're, yeah, mm. under the, you know, those outside tables. Mm-hmm. That's where all the food is, but it's, like, raining. Yeah, there's mm-hmm. no way you're going to a stranger's barbecue when it's raining out, dude. Yeah, I'd be like, uh, nah. Maybe not. <laughs> Unless it's Reika asking... There you go. There you go. Ray, Ray if she looks like them. Sakurai Reika, like, yeah, sure. <laughs> I'll, I'll show up in the park. It's fine. Like, I'll show up if it sucks. 20 minutes bail. away in the rain? I think I could do it. Yeah. All right. Uh, some things they do at the party. Uh, only two of the three girls that they invited come. Oh, because uh, of the she rain. Bailed. She, she bailed. She bailed because of the rain. Uh-huh. 
Waco uh, wasn't what? hot enough to get them, dude. <laughs> two out of three. Two out of three. She don't swing that way, though. <laughs> Who, Rika? Or... No, the girl. No, the girl. We all know oh, okay. Rika. Yeah, we all know Rika. <laughs> uh, and then uh, apparently one of the guys is going to the Olympics for karate. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, because they were asking, like, uh, has, have any of you been to Japan? Or yeah, yeah. And then he said in 2020 I'm going uh, yeah. for the Olympics. There, there was, like, also one of the locals, right? She spoke Japanese. And she was Japanese. Oh, she was Japanese. Yeah, there was two, there was two Japanese girls there. Or from Japan. Ah, okay. So that made it way easier. They didn't have to <laughs> speak that much yeah, English. yeah, yeah. The girl just translated half the time. Right, right. But for some reason, they still put subtitles on her. Um. Mm. Anyway, uh, then they play like a Hawaiian game. It's kind of like the point your finger, turn the direction. Yeah, achi muite hoi. Hawaii. It's basically yeah. it's exactly the it's, same. It's exactly, yeah. yeah they, they play that. Nothing nothing real exciting there. Um, just them goofing around. Uh, and then afterwards, they go to a hotel and then they have to give a tour of the hotel. Part of like Probably part of the reason why they're there, getting that paid sponsorship. Mm-hmm. Kind of like the juice shop. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, so first up, Matsumura goes to get uh, pancakes. Uh, Sakurai and Maichun start talking behind, behind her back. She gets real mad at them. <laughs> the pancakes look good, though. Yeah, the panca- those $18 Damn, pancakes look pretty good. They are expensive. <laughs> I mean, it's a hotel. Mm-hmm. And then uh, Sakurai gets a massage because she's at that relaxation area where there's like a jacuzzi and stuff. And then, uh, it's not that kind of massage, Jimmy. Yeah. She didn't take her clothes off. Uh, That's and when then... I stopped watching. <laughs> <laughs> Just clothes. And apparently she asked for, for, for like a rough massage. She's like, okay, this may be like a little too rough. It's breaking my back, dude. <laughs> and then the masseuse says, is like, oh yeah, uh, she has problems with her, with her intestines, right? And the second was like, oh yeah. And then she's like, oh yeah, uh, it's her liver and a small intestine. Uh, it's probably from drinking a lot. <laughs> and Sakura's like, yeah, no, 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 I'm, I'm an idol. <laughs> He's like, they, maybe that's they why. They turned up too hard at the barbecue last night. That's <laughs> yeah, 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 dude. There's stuff that happened that they not they did not mm. show on the show. Yeah. It's like, oh, dude, you can't, you can't be yeah. kicking it with Etomisa anymore, dude. <laughs> Etomisa's liver is just Etomisa black. Paisan just wrecking me every night. We go out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Um, and then and then Mai Chun does a high tension hotel tour of the room. The room was like the suite, dude. It was like mm-hmm. huge. Mm-hmm. But we got that Mai Chun high tension, so it's all good. Yeah, there was. It had like a huge balcony. It was like in a, a corner room, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So there was like the the outside beds that overlooked to the ocean and stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Scenic. They're yeah. like, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then next, uh. They have a final dinner. They all wear black like they're going to a funeral. Um, and then they eat some s- seafood that costs like $50. And they eat a s- piece of steak that costs $50. And oh, yeah. they recount their memories. Honestly, this part could have been taken out. <laughs> it's, it's the end of an adventure, Josh. I mean, but it's two here's hours the catch. Worth. Here's the catch. There's going to be another episode with the Hawaiian what? trip. And that was going to be two hours long, 120 minutes. God damn! What and that's gonna what? that's just gonna be like all the extra stuff. So, so it's gonna I be like, start season two already, please. I assume that you know that episode isn't gonna involve any of the English stuff, right? It's just gonna be their their uh, their adventures. It is, like in, from the the first part, the previous episode, mm-hmm. it shows them go to that jungle thing. It didn't show that at all in this episode. That's so the next episode. It, it shows that with my tune crying. And Matsumura getting distracted by shopping. <laughs> See, so I, I, that's probably just a, a normal, like, you know, travel location style, right? It's yeah, not, yeah, yeah. I feel like it's more like that. Yeah, it's, but it's, it's still probably going to try to involve some English, I imagine. Okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. It's in the name of the, the show. They got to work it in somehow. <laughs> yeah, True. yeah. And that comes out uh, the end of this month. I think a week after the regular episode. But Yeah, I was going to say, but so is the, the second season. Yeah, it might be a week after I think. Yeah, because because we know they already filmed it. Thankfully, our yeah. boy Nick is returning as well. Uh, so not, I'm, not I'm, the next episode, on the one so after. I, well, I so mean, I like, assume the new season. It's the twenty. Or at least in the picture, that's what we see. It's gonna air on the twenty fourth, then, right? I think so. Right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Should be our boy Nick back yeah. at it again. I w- I really want to ask him how it's like to work with Shinuchi Mai. Because she mm-hmm. knew she understands English. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, 
throughout the the two episodes of the Hawaii special, like she was the one like communicating the most. Yeah, with yeah, all yeah. The yeah. Locals. Mm-hmm. And she would like she she'd understand some of the words they say. Yeah, yeah. It's like her understanding. I think was really good. Even they even said that in the regular No Diego episode. Yeah, when she was on before. So... I want to ask him what it's like working with Yutan, dude. Oh, <laughs> Yutan, bruh. <laughs> Does does she melt your heart like she melts ours? We'll see. We'll ask him. Mm. And and if you like Nick so much, you can watch him this Friday on twitch.tv slash slow club which he will be on. And he will be with two which he claims the cutest comedian girls to ever exist. In the world. Uh-huh. <laughs> so please enjoy Sick that. Idea. <laughs> and then afterwards we'll stream that one thing from the other group Chozet's mm. <laughs> uh, kawaii Nick yeah and you could keep following here on twitch.tv slash slope club if you're interested in that you can listen to this podcast in audio form through all the audio formats iTunes, Google Play, Spotify any of those as well subscribe to our YouTube channel which you can see other type of content maybe soon and maybe yeah. in the future as well as the finished episode of this, if you haven't caught it live, because there is no VOD of this. Yes. So, yeah. That yeah. does it. That does it. That does it. Uh, emotes coming soon. Yeah. Thank you for all the people who subscribed while the, the show was going. Thank you. And mm-hmm. that's it for the episode. Thank Hooray. you. Guys. Goodbye. Bye.